I want to congratulate the state of Israel uh, on uh, brokering the deal with United Arab, Arab Emirates and Abu Dhabi. And today, Flight 971, the first direct flight uh, connected the two countries. That is Israel and the United Arab Emirates, or what you call Dubai. It's a shame that we in Kenya have sat here trying to establish a flight, a direct flight from Nairobi to Tel Aviv for as long as I can remember. And uh, nothing but our laziness and to a large extent our ignorance that stops us fly from flying between Nairobi and Tel Aviv. The truth be told, <clears throat> that flight inaugurated today starts a lot of business, sets up a lot of business for Israel and the United Arab Emirates, estimated at about 6.5 billion US dollars. That's about 700 billion Kenya shillings, or about, uh, or roughly about, uh, say, say that 40 percent, 40, 50 percent, 40 percent of our, of our normal budget. I want to call upon the president to ignore all these people who are uh, COVID merchants. You know them in total. And look at that link between Nairobi and Tel Aviv so that we can also have a circuit. Tel Aviv, uh, Dubai, or Abu Dhabi, and Nairobi. And we may be able to scoop a bit of that uh, business. Perhaps, if not 600, uh, uh, six, if not 6.5 billion dollars, maybe one, maybe one uh, billion dollars. It's good enough for a start, particularly with an ailing Kenya Airways like yes, we know it. Congratulations, Israel. Congratulations, uh, Abu Dhabi. Congratulations, United Arab Emirates or Dubai.